Hello everybody. Hey y'all. Uh, welcome to episode two of Solo. Today I am not leaving yet. I'm leaving in less than 24 hours. I am going to San Francisco with my family because my flight is at the butt crack of dawn tomorrow. So we are staying in a hotel so that I can have a smooth sailing departure. And how I'm feeling right now, I'm excited. Right now I'm excited. I'm getting excited. I'm like shaky. I'm like a little asthmatic-y. I should probably take my puffer because I'm freaking out. Yesterday was kind of rough a little bit. I was crying. I cry every day. Yesterday I was like kind of scared. I was feeling really like anxious and I was feeling uh, just not, I was not excited at all, but had a pep talk with my mom and my boo, so I'm feeling a lot better now. I just have to remember that everybody is supporting me. All you guys are supporting me. All my friends, all my family, um, my boo, everybody's behind me. So it would be a really big waste if I left really depressed because that would defeat the point of me going. So I've decided to be more positive and I'm excited and I want to go do good and I want to make you guys proud. So, um, here we go. We're driving to the city. I'm with my brother, one of my brothers. And then with my mom. Hi! And my stepdad. We're going to the hotel because my flight's at the butt crack of dawn tomorrow, so. Good morning. Good morning. What time is it right now? Um, what time is it? It is in the morning. 3.36 a.m. 3.36 a.m. Here we go. Here we Here go. Here we go, folks. Hey y'all, I'm about to board my flight. I cried like a baby. Um, my bag was way too heavy, so I had to empty a bunch of it out. But other than that, we're good to go. So I'll see you guys in two hours in Vancouver. I landed in Vancouver and the airport is beautiful and now I have to go find my gate so here we go I didn't even cry that much how many hours it's been maybe it was 10 or 11 hours just this flight and then the other flight was two and a half hours so it's like 13 hours so in the air but I'm here <sighs> I'm here but I still have to take the bus so I have like another two hours until I'm here 
It's like 4 o'clock in the afternoon in Korea. But I landed, I have a bunch of bags. And we're almost there. Ooh. That's all mine. I'm here. I'm here. So I'm here. They dropped me off at an apartment. It's not my apartment because mine is being redone. They're doing the wallpaper on it, I guess, and it's not ready. So I am staying with a different teacher who is not here. So I'll meet him soon. <laughs> it's pretty hot. It's not as hot as California, but... I guess I can give you a tour of my house for this weekend. Let's let's do that. Yeah. You come in. It's a three bedroom place. This one guy lives in. Here's the bathroom. It's one of the ones where it's just like a shower. Uh, I kind of miss home a little bit. The living room. The dude's room that I don't even know. The kitchen's kind of cute. And this is where I will be staying for the next two days. Yeah. Um, it's like 7 o'clock in Korea, which means it's like 2 o'clock in the morning in the U.S. So I've been up for like almost exactly 24 hours. I feel kind of woozy. So I'm going to go to sleep. I have to be at the school at 10.20 tomorrow because I have to go to the hospital to get all my medical business done, so I'm here. This is where I live now, so yes. I'll see you guys in the morning.